Hey there folks, I'm Redshirt and I'm here to give you uh, some advice on the use of your Steam Deck with an external monitor. Um, maybe some of you have noticed that if you connect the Steam Deck through uh, a USB dock, dongle, whatever you use, to an external monitor, um, that uh, some games play in the resolution of the monitor, some games um, for in no way, shape or sound, can you put them in that resolution that you're used to? Um, there is a thing for that. I don't know why some games do it and why some don't. But I am going to show you. Let me see here. Mm -hmm. There we go. Here we have my Stream Deck uh, library with installed games. First, I'm going to show you Portal 2. Do keep in mind, our dearest resolution for the menu works perfectly fine in the resolution of the monitor. In this case, 1440p. Uh, going into the game itself. Yes, skipping, skipping. If you have not changed anything, you're gonna notice, you go and go to video, look, this one automatically gets the right resolution. No worries, no fault, absolutely fine. So we're gonna skip back out of this game and we're gonna boot up, for example, uh, one game that I've noticed had this problem, Hellblade Senua Sacrifice. Boom. Booting it up. Takes a little bit, of course. Yes. Next, next. We want to go to the settings. Go to the settings. There we go. Now, I go to options, graphics, and you'll see it's in uh, 1152 by 720. Not even the full resolution that the uh, Steam Deck is possible on. If I try to switch between it, 1280, 720, that's the only options I get. So, what's going on? Well, I don't know why. But I have the resolution for you. Firm. Because it's probably uh, I'm I'm assuming Portal 2 works great because it is a native Steam uh, native Valve game and it's perfectly optimized. But if you go to this game, Senua Sacrifice, and you're probably gonna have to do it for most of your games. You go to your oh, nope, not there. Your settings and to properties. Then you have uh, let's see which one was it? I forgot, I forgot, I forgot. No, I think it's general. Oh, there we go. Game resolution. It's on default. That's it's default on default. What you're going to want to do is don't pick the resolution for your screen, which you can do, but then when you put up the stream deck, it's going to be all wonky and putting it back. Just put it on native. And now that I've put it on native, I'm going to boot up sending with sacrifice again. I'm going to go to the uh, boot up screen again, of course. Mm -hmm. yeah. And what we're going to be seeing once we boot up the game itself, we're going to get a few more resolution options there. Of course, you're gonna, still going to have to make sure you put in the right resolution options at the uh, when you start it up. Uh, as far as I know, once you have done this once and you put it on the right resolution for the monitor, it will keep that way, but check it every time you connect it, just to be sure. We go here. At, first of all, it's in 1280, uh, 800, which was not an option before. But look at that. Look at what we got here. Much better resolution options. Until right here, which is the perfect one for my screen. Uh, back, I want to... No, I want to apply the changes. Oi. Back to the other way then. Made that faster. There we go. Apply. Uh, confirm. And now you see it's a bit more... Uh, it's a bit tighter on this graphics. It looks a bit better. And also when playing on screen, you're going to be playing in full resolution. Uh, keep in mind, the Steam Deck, how po however powerful it is, um, you might have to dial down, down some settings uh, when you're playing in full resolution on your monitor uh, as opposed to playing on the smaller screen um, because it is still a mobile PC. But keep in mind, this is the best way for you to get your, uh, uh, yeah, well, to get your perfect resolution uh, going on your external monitor if you're docking your Steam Deck. Hope that was helpful. See you next time.